What's up guys, to a FIFA 15 player prediction video and today we're going to do Barcelona because someone did comment them down below so if you want your team reviewed obviously leave a comment down below and if you do disagree with any of these ratings obviously leave a comment as well so let's get into the number one this week and that is Ter Stegen because we always like to do a goalkeeper, a defender, a couple of midfielders and a striker so the first one this week is Ter Stegen as I did just say and 83 rated I reckon he will be on FIFA 15 I'm not quite sure because I haven't actually seen him in real life he's actually a really young goalkeeper, highly rated so I think he should be the number one choice at uh, Barcelona and if he is that card it's very similar to Valdez not as good positioning but generally it's got very similar stats and hopefully he's not as bad as Valdez because Valdez was just absolutely awful so hopefully Ter Stegen has a really good time there and develops very nicely. Next up we do have Javier Mascherano and I wasn't sure what defender to do and I'm not quite sure if he will be a centre-back come the next season. We could have probably done for Marlon but um, I think he will be in the top 10 transfers of the week so It'll leave a, I'll leave a link down below if I do remember. If not, go check out my video. So yeah, Mascherano, I put him up to an 85 because he did have a very, very good World Cup. And generally, his passing should be a lot better. Like, his passing ability at the World Cup was absolutely fantastic. I don't know if it's a defender thing. Like, defenders always seem to have bad defending, so... Uh, bad uh, passing, sorry. So maybe that'll go up quite a bit. Next up, we do have Alex Song. And he definitely should be downgraded. I think he's actually gone to AC Milan on a free... I could be wrong, it could be a loan, I'm not quite sure, but uh, yeah, an 80 rate of card, it's still decent, but it's just not quite as good as that uh, 83 rate of card. When he was at Arsenal, he had a fantastic season, went to Barcelona, and he kind of just dropped off a bit. That happens to so many players, and obviously Song will probably be downgraded to an 80, maybe a 79, maybe even a 78 if they are really harsh. Next up we do have Xavi, and... I think it will happen, um, go down to us 86, he's obviously retired from international, still got that incredible passing ability, I've only downgraded it by one, uh, but generally his stats will go down quite a bit next year, I think he will be an 86, he could be an 87, a lot of people on Twitter did say 86, that's what I went for in the end, so still a very good card, very good passing ability, decent dribbling and obviously okay defending and shots, so yeah, decent card for Xavi, and the final one this week is Neymar, and he probably will be moved out wide to a left winger, because that's what all of his informs that's what he does for brazil as well and that's what uh, barcelona will probably do next year they'll play suarez or messi on the right and then obviously suarez or messi down the middle and then neymar down the left obviously all three of them can vary in between the uh, three but he'll probably be a left winger with some very good stats on his card he had a very good world cup he did drag uh, brazil all the way to the semi-final and then obviously lost against uh, germany very emphatically and an 87 rate of card will be perfectly fine for him maybe 86 but i think he will be an 87 maybe even 88 just because ea do love barcelona and messi and all that hype so yeah, I didn't think I should do Messi because I think he should stay the same rate in 94 still. Um, but yeah, we'll have to see what they do. Um, it's only three weeks now till FIFA 15. So yeah, smash the like button, subscribe if you're on your channel, and see you soon. Bye.